Hi guys, it's Chrissy and welcome back to the channel. So today we're actually doing an, another apartment renovation. I haven't done one of these in I think quite a while now. I think it's been a few weeks since the last time I I did an apartment. But yeah, I was just really in the mood to, I don't know, just decorate without having, you know, like a specific family in mind or having a specific storyline in mind or anything for the house. And I just thought, I don't know, it would be fun to do something smaller since the past couple of weeks I've been doing a bit more of, a bit more, my builds have been a bit more on the bigger side. I, I don't know if that made any sense. I'm struggling with my English today, <laughs> apparently. But, um, yeah, so this is an autumnal apartment. And I don't know why I decided to go for an autumnal apartment since it's actually not autumn here. <laughs> I know it's autumn in the northern hemisphere, but since I live in the southern hemisphere, it's actually spring. So, I don't know. I think it was just because autumn is actually my favorite season out of the year. So, I think that's why. And, I don't know. I was just really in the mood to play with some more richer colors, dark woods, you know, some oranges and greens and stuff like that. So, I just decided to do this autumnal apartment. And it is actually a, a restricted packs apartment as well. So obviously I used base game. And then I used city living. Obviously because you know you have to have city living to have apartments in the first place. And then I used seasons as well since I thought it would... I don't know, seasons have has a lot of... I don't know, really... I don't, I don't want to say it's autumn, autumn specific like uh, furniture and stuff but... A lot of the items that came with Seasons are absolutely perfect for, you know, autumn and stuff specifically because a lot of them have really nice dark wood colors and I just wanted to use it. I didn't want to just use City Living because I did have kind of an idea of what I wanted the apartment to look like or the style that I wanted it to be and City Living didn't have as much of those style like objects as I wanted. I don't know if I'm making any sense whatsoever, but yeah, about this build, it is obviously you guys will be able to see in the top corner that it is built in the 19 Culpeper House apartment, so it's in the Spice District, and I actually didn't change up the floor plan too much. I actually kept in everything about this build. I didn't cut out the floor plan, you know, any of that, which is, you know, not something that I normally do. I do cut out the floor plan usually. But I thought since it was an apartment and it only took me about, I think like 45 minutes to build this whole thing, that I would just keep everything in and let you guys see all of it. But yeah, I didn't change up the floor plan too much. So it is a two bedroom, one bathroom apartment. It could be a three bedroom apartment if you wanted to convert the study into another bedroom maybe. I This house, this apartment obviously has a study as well that leads out onto the balcony area and yeah I don't have any specific sims for it in mind when I built this when I came to doing the study I did think that one of the sims in the house maybe one of the parents or maybe one of the kids is a teenager since the child bed the kids bedroom does have two beds so you can have four sims in here but I thought maybe one of the kids is an artist a teenager and they're an artist or one of the parents is an artist or something like that since I did add in an easel and you know some canvas racks and a bunch of canvases on the floor and stuff in the in the study so I thought one of one of the sims is probably an artist although you could really easily remove those remove all of the painting stuff and add in like I don't know workout equipment or a chess table or whatever you wanted for your for whatever sims you have in this apartment it's really easy to change up and yeah the kids bedroom it's not too girly although I don't know I don't think I had you know specific genders in mind when I built it but yeah it is a bit more on the girly side I would say I don't know there's not a lot of pink in it I tried to go for, you know, oranges and greens through and some yellow throughout the whole apartment. I tried to make the bedrooms the bedrooms match that theme as well. But yeah, the 
children's bedroom i thought one of them could be a teenager and one of them could be a child or two children or something i don't think there would be two teenagers since i did add in a dollhouse and some toys and stuff so i don't think teenagers would have that but i mean to each their own if you wanted your teenagers to still play with doll with dolls and stuff you could have them do that i mean i know that i played with my barbies until I was like 13 years old and then I gave them away so yeah it's definitely conceivable to play with them when you're that old obviously I know that to this day I still want to go into the toy section of the supermarket and buy some of the dolls that they have kind of not to really to play with them but just to have them kind of as I don't know collectors pieces I know a lot of the dolls that I had you don't get anymore you, don't, you can't buy them today I know I had all of the Bratz dolls and yeah you can't buy them today you don't get those versions of them anymore so I I'm really annoyed that I didn't keep them if I'm honest but yeah I don't know I yeah as I said basically the kids bedroom could be for children or teenagers it all depends on what your sims's personalities are and this apartment is actually not that expensive either. It's, yeah, I think it's about 90,000 simoleons, just over 90,000 simoleons. So it's kind of a budget apartment, not really. It's not, yeah, it's not like a starter apartment by any means. But I don't know, I really like the way it turned out. And I'm not really used to building with this much orange, if I'm honest. I know a while back, I don't know, like months ago, I was going through this really big orange, you know, like phase where every build that I have built that built had to have some orange in it for some reason. I have no idea why. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I really like how this turned out. I think that, I don't know, I don't know if you guys would normally think of, you know, green when you think of autumn. I do for some reason. I do think of some green when I think of autumn colors. I don't know if that's just me or if it's a normal thing to think of green when you think of autumn. I mean, obviously not just green, but you know, green with yellows and oranges and stuff like that. Since a lot of the trees where I live actually don't change color like at all. I know a lot of the places in the US especially that I know of, obviously they're gorgeous in the autumn time and where i live it just no i live near mountains but the trees on the mountains are evergreens i think yeah i think they're evergreens or something or yeah oak trees i don't know what tree kind of trees they are in all honesty but i know that they don't change color they don't lose their leaves or anything so they're basically green all year round so I guess that's why I think of green when I think of autumn as well, since we don't really have autumn the way a lot of you guys have it in the US, you know, with Halloween and Thanksgiving and, you know, all of the autumn colors and stuff like that. We don't really have that year. But yeah, as I said, it is still one of my favorite seasons. I think it is actually my favorite season. And then, yeah, I think winter is my second favorite season. I absolutely despise summer with a burning passion. <laughs> I hate absolutely everything about it. I can't think of one thing that I actually like about summer. But yeah, I I don't know. This voiceover has been a complete and utter mess. I haven't recorded a voiceover in a few days. And yeah, I don't know. It's always it always amazes me how quickly you can get out of practice if you don't do this like every day or every other day. <laughs> but yeah, we're almost done with the apartment. We just we're just finishing up the balcony and then we're done but yeah if you guys are new to the channel and you haven't subscribed already feel free to hit that subscribe button and remember to turn on the notification bell to be notified of every time i upload a new video but yeah i hope you guys are having an absolutely awesome day and that your week has been great and you're having a really fun weekend and yeah i will see you guys all in my next video bye everyone
We played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, play fall and free, without a care in the world. I was one rich little girl. Back, all the way back to them days Running around in a gown and a crown Barefoot No mistake ever kept me Spent summers catching fireflies and winters on our skates. One big smile across my face. We used to dance our way to church on Sundays. Mama set the pace. Daydream.